Mr. Men Go to the Dentist by Roger Hargreaves. It was time for Little Miss Sunshine to have a checkup at the dentist, but she was very nervous. You'll be fine, said Little Miss Wise, as long as you have brushed your teeth twice a day like me. It is important to clean your teeth thoroughly. She added, "Mr. Slow only cleans his teeth once a day, but that is because he is so slow. It takes him from breakfast until lunch time to brush his teeth, tooth by tooth, by tooth by tooth." Everyone cleans their teeth. You can use an ordinary toothbrush, or you can use an electric toothbrush, or if you are the richest man in the world, you can hire someone to clean your teeth for you. How ridiculous! Hmm. If you don't clean your teeth, you might end up looking like Little Miss Naughty. <laughs> Although she was just playing a trick, a trick on her dentist, Mrs. Bright. Oh! Everyone needs to go for a checkup at the dentist at least once a year. Everyone except for Mr. Bump. He tends to go more often. Bump. Poor old Mr. Bump. Oh! Little Miss Sunshine arrived early for her appointment at the dentist. She had to wait in the waiting room with Mr. Muddle. Little Miss Sunshine nearly fell off her chair when she caught sight of his teeth, but it was not as awful as it looked. He had just muddled up his tube of toothpaste with a tube of food coloring. Oh! Mrs. Bright had a lot of interesting patients, some of whom she looked forward to seeing, and some of whom she didn't, like Mr. Tickle. Miss Tiny was much better behaved, but she was still not an easy patient. It was very difficult to see into such a tiny mouth. Mrs. Bright had to use a magnifying glass. In fact, Mrs. Bright had lots of difficult patients. Little Miss Durbin refused to open her mouth. Little Miss Somersault could not sit still. Mr. Nose's nose got in the way. Um. And Mr. Topsy Turvy was all upside down. Oh, 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 oh. But she also had lots of good patients. Mr. Strong had very strong teeth. So strong that he could bite into a coconut. <clears throat> Mr. Fuzzy had very, very clean teeth, and Mr. Perfect had perfect teeth. Mrs. Bright particularly enjoyed Little Miss Chatterbox's visits. It was the one time she was able to get a word in edgeways, as Little Miss Chatterbox couldn't talk with her mouth wide open. <coughs> little Miss Sunshine was still a little nervous when Mrs. Bright called her into the examination room. Little Miss Sunshine sat in the chair and opened her mouth wide. <gasps> well, I never cried, Mrs. Bright. You have, Little Miss Sunshine held her breath. Yee.